For hundreds of years, historians have pondered the question, who was Christopher Columbus? Well, author Steve Berry decided to take on that subject in his book, The Columbus Affair. And he joins us this morning to tell us more about it. Good morning. Good morning. So I know you were just telling me your, your family actually lives in St. Augustine. Mm -hmm. So I don't know if you know this, but Rhode Islanders really celebrate Christopher Columbus. It's a, it's a big deal here, and we have a huge Italian population. But what made you decide to you know, explore Christopher Columbus. Because we know nothing about him. We don't, we don't know where he was born, where he was raised. We don't know his name. We don't know what he looked like. We don't know how he got to America. We don't know what happened when he got here. We know almost nothing about Christopher Columbus. And I didn't realize how little we know about him. And then there's a great secret, a secret uh, that, that, I come, that I came across, that Columbus may well have been Jewish. And that's what forms the basis of this book, that he may have had a connection with the Jews. And uh, I added a little twist to the story to make it relevant still today mm -hmm. and made a modern day thriller out of it. Now I was reading online that you get your inspiration for these books in many different places. One of your books, you even were watching the Discovery Channel Mm -hmm. and it's, it part, you know, sparked your interest. So what exactly sparked your interest to, to delve into Christopher? When I found a book called Sales of Hope by Simon Wiesenthal, I stumbled onto it one day in an old bookshop. Wiesenthal wrote the book 40 years ago and it, and it first postulated the idea that Columbus may have been Jewish. And he has a very interesting theory in there. And when, when he wrote that book, it was kind of uh, out in left field. Mm -hmm. Not so out in left field anymore. In fact, it's most likely true. Wow, and your lead character, Tom Sagan, tell us what his adventures are inside this book. Disgraced newspaper reporter at the end of his rope who gets thrown into this adventure. He goes from Florida to Vienna to Prague to Jamaica. And there's actually a connection between Jamaica and Prague that involves Christopher Columbus. And you actually visited I did. Those I places. went to Prague and Jamaica. Uh, the Columbus family controlled the island of Jamaica for 150 years. And a lot of people don't know that. They had total con control over the island. And some things happened while they had control of that island that still have relevance today. Now, what genre is this book? It's a modern day international suspense thriller. Where it has a little historical angle to it. Now, speaking of thriller, as I said, you're not from around here and you're actually going to be joining some other thriller offers. Tell us about this event happening at Brown. Yeah, tonight, 630 at Solomon Hall. I'm going to be with Nelson DeMille, David Baldock. Lisa Gardner and the great R.L. Stein and we're doing a, a free symposium we're going to be talking signing books uh, uh, interacting with folks it's free and it's open to the public it starts at 6:30. Wow so what types of topics will you be talking about? Thrillers mainly, mainly. <laughs> just lots of thrillers uh, John Land who's a lo who lives here in Providence a thriller writer is going to moderate it and we're going to be going into uh, all, all the aspects of thrillers uh, interacting with the audience so I encourage a lot of people to come out. Fantastic and will your book be available there? Everything will be available all of them uh, will have their books there available. I think between the five of us, there's like a billion books between us, which is kind of interesting. That's amazing. Uh, the, most of which with R.L. Stein, who has the vast majority, <laughs> but there's like a billion books between us. Yeah. Wow, and you said it's going to be happening at Solomon Hall? 6.30 tonight. Fantastic. Well, very exciting, especially for all of our bookworms out there, including myself. Thank you so Thanks, much, Steve, you, for coming you, in. You. Sounds like a great read, and for more information on where to get the Columbus Affair or for tonight's event, you can head to WPRI.com and click on The Roadshow.